ビールちょうだい When you order a beer at Kayabuki Tavern, the waiter scampering to your table is in a monkey suit. A real one. From the hot hand towels to the ashtrays to taking your money and delivering your change. Five year old Fuku chan and 12 year old Ya chan are working the tables, unlike thousands of food service employees who are expected to lose their jobs this year. It's a tough time for Tokyo's 160,000 restaurants. 2008 will be a record breaker for the number of restaurant bankruptcies in Tokyo. Kayabuki says, sure, it's relying on a gimmick, but that gimmick is keeping it open. Because of my monkeys, we get all kinds of customers, says the tavern's owner. We're not affected by the economic downturn. They're even bringing in tourists from around the globe. It's crazy. <laughs> the Fenners from St. Joseph, Michigan saw the waiter monkeys on YouTube and just had to see it for themselves as part of their Tokyo vacation. Not exactly something they'd see back home. I don't think they'd allow it. I mean, I see absolutely nothing wrong with it, but the animal rights people probably wouldn't allow it. The owner gets around that by working his pet monkeys only two hours a day. Health department inspectors gave this a green light, as long as the monkeys wear clothes, says Otsuka. Now they're a nightly fixture. Even helping to answer the phone. All they ask is a soybean or two from customers who are eating up the monkey show and the tavern's daily dishes. And for one restaurant surviving a global economic slowdown, that's something to cheer about. Hi. Hi. Kyung La, CNN, Utsunomiya, Japan.